Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, what I need for you to do right now is I need for you to go back to the beach for me. <laughs> I love you guys. I'm back at home. But you can give me that good energy by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. You can just do all those beautiful, magical mother trucking things that you do to me so well here at Talia's Tarot. So, Pisces, I'm going to slap down a Z or you want there. Oh. Ah. So good to have my holy water back. You know what time it is. Tarot is now in session. The most honorable judge, T. T. Dong, presiding. You may all be seated. Oh, oh, Pisces, by the way. Um, Ruby, remember I told you all about my, uh, well, my, well, she's my friend, and it's my friend's daughter. A little 16-year-old Ruby Lee, country music sensation. She is going to be on The Voice tonight on NBC. Everybody tune in. I will. I flew back just to be at the official Ruby Lee watch party with her mom, her sister, and uh, all of the fans there over in Cottleville, Missouri. So I'm back over here in Missouri. Woo! Yeehaw! Ride him, cowboy! Well, I live in Illinois. I mean, I'm like literally 10 minutes away from the Missouri line, so I might as well be a Missourian. <laughs> You know what time it is. Yeah. We're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with or whatever energy might be trickling down towards you, my beautiful loves. Whatever the case is, we're going to make it all good together. We're going to hit it and quit it. We're going to hit it, get it, hit it, quit that shit together. <laughs> Louie missed me so much. Bailiff Louie. He missed me so much. He got excited, so excited. He was so confused, looked so depressed, and, and then he was just, he went nuts. He was jumping everywhere, going crazy, and he ended up hurting his little paw, and he can't even jump on the couch. So he's a little hurt. He's going to be fine. I keep a careful watch of him. He's not crying, but he's laying on the floor next to his wood scratching post, and he just wagged his tail at me. So, um, yeah, so send prayers for my little bailiff, Lulu. So... Show! I missed him so much, too, guys. I really, I mean, I really did. I, it's just horrible. Okay. Show! Okay. All right, Pisces. This table is so much smaller, too. I have a tiny table, but this is vintage, okay? This is a vintage table. You can't just get these anywhere anymore. You know I like a good sword fight, too. I got my sword back. <laughs> I missed all my little gadgets. Anyway, down on the table, I've got the Three of Wands. I've got the Four of Swords. I've got the King of Pentacles. The overall energy for the reading today here is the Four of Wands. So, uh, somebody here is wanting to get together here with you, Pisces. Uh, they've been waiting on you for quite some time. Four of Swords. I figure this person here... Um, has been struggling here with some heartache okay so this person I feel right now is is trying to heal themselves we've got the king of Pentacles down here on the table okay so this could be your energy this could be their energy king of Pentacles though is a very wealthy individual here very monogamous very sweet and has got a really good heart I need some more holy water I can't get enough holy water now so we're gonna chalk we're gonna talk to those four of swords here and see what this person uh, is healing from here, okay? <sighs> What's this person healing from with the four swords? Ouch. Oh, shit. That hit me real hard in the face. This person here, okay, is healing from being a fool. They could literally be healing from being an actual fool, okay? We're going to get one more on that here from the, con for the contrast here. So, what's this four of swords with the fool, please? 
What's this Four of Swords with the Fool, please? Four of Swords with the Fool. Let's go top to bottom. That felt a little shaky to me. Four of Swords with the Fool. What's going on here? Jeez. Okay, the deck's acting weird. Four of Swords with the Fool. I'm glad to have my decks back, too. Okay. Okay. Seems like Pisces. <laughs> uh, they feel like you've abandoned them. Yep. Yep. Like you just up and packed your shit. And you were like, I'm getting on a ship, a cruise ship here. And I, hi, Bailiff. Come on, baby. Oh, my baby. He's walking slow today, too. Oh, he's going to try. Yeah, he wants to be in court. Him miss court. Him miss court. Yeah. Oh, he's my sweet little Bailiff that missed court. It's okay, baby. Oh, I feel so bad for him. It's just not fun. He's getting on the couch, but he can't jump. He's got to, like, step up. It's making me... I'm going to cry. Oh, my God. I get back. I'm excited to see him. He gets excited, and then he hurts himself. It's just... So, this person here feels like... Yeah, th that you just abandoned them here is what they feel. Like, you guys were... Everything was going good, right? Okay? You guys were doing your thing. And then all of a sudden, you just uh, up and left somehow and left this person feeling abandoned. Left them feeling neglected here, okay? So, why did Pisces abandon this person? Why did Pisces abandon this person? Okay, because you wanted clarity here, okay? There was something here where you basically were not getting clarity in this situation, and uh, you were like, you know what? I'm not. I'm just. I'm not getting clarity here. Okay, I'm tired of wondering, get, playing the guessing game here. It's not a goddamn game show here. I should have better clarity here. And so you just up and packed your ships and you sailed on out. Oh my god. So what was the clarity here that Pisces was needing out of this situation? Oh, there's Bailiff. He's moving slow. He's not going to get on the couch. Hey, baby. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. He's moving slow. It's okay, boy. So what clarity was Pisces needing here in this situation? Okay. What clarity here? You wanted this person. You you were literally like, you were probably like, I know this person's in love with me. Yep. And this is your energy here. And you're showing up here saying, I wanted this person to... What? Share the cup, right? Share the cup. Tell me how you feel here, okay? So basically right here, see how this cup has got like a handkerchief on it? So this is telling me that this person here wasn't sharing how they felt about you. Mm -hmm. Yep. And now this person here, uh, you know, they've moved past the heartbreak here. They're still carrying it, okay? But I feel like this person is struggling right now. So we're going to talk to the King of Pentacles, and we'll see why the King of Pentacles is there. Poor Bailiff. Oh, my God. This is going to make me cry. Oh, boy. So what, what's this King of Pentacles energy down here on the table for? Show me the King of Pentacles. Okay. That's like an explosion. There's an explosion of energy here. What's the King of Pentacles down here on the table? Okay. Well, seems like this person here... Knight of Wands wants to come in here real quick, okay? Knight of Wands to the King of Wands, uh-huh. And here this person, the knight orders the king, okay? This person is missing you. And notice these phalluses, how freaking, you know, they're like, there's lots of energy coming off these phalluses here. So this person here, I feel like is coming to you with some kind of passionate, communication here okay it's 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 slow moving here but what is this this person's embodying a lot of fire though a lot of fire in this reading so I've in it with that king of pentacles here I have a this person is very much financially well to do but they are definitely uh, more of a king of wands energy here okay kind of fickle in love here okay so what is this um and the, uh, you know, the Ace of Wands is also extending an olive branch here, okay? Uh, as well as a creative endeavor, the spark of a new idea. 
So all of a sudden, now they've got a spark of something here. So what's the spark with the Ace of Wands? I think I want some scrambled eggs and chorizo. I do. I do. What's the spark here with the Ace of Wands? I don't have any chorizo. Okay. What's one more on death? They want to change something here. What does this person wants, want to transform this Ace of Wands? How, how do they want to transform this Ace of Wands here? Whoops. By standing their ground here, okay? So this person is wanting to transform something and stand their ground here. And I feel like they want to be more nurturing here and they want to be more giving. So why does this person want to be more nurturing and giving towards Pisces, please? Why? 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 Because of the chariot. Forward movement here, okay? So, Pisces, the thing with the chariot here, and they're all different in different decks, you know, the emperor, of course, he drives the chariot here. So, this person here is coming in as a balanced emperor here, okay? So, they're wanting to move this forward here. And there's literally the yin and the yang here. I got another deck, and he's a freaking sideways. The horse's legs are broken, and he's it's like, crack, crack. So, they're coming in here wanting to move this situation here with the chariot. So, what is this chariot? Why are they wanting to move this situation forward with the chariot? Why? Because this is what they're determined to do. This is the determination. So what is this person waiting on here with this Three of Wands energy? What's this person waiting on with the Three of Wands energy? Scrambled eggs, chorizo, and avocado with cilantro. I'm not, I know, guys. <laughs> I got it bad. Okay. They're waiting to make a decision here. So what is this decision they're waiting to make? The Three to the Two of Wands. What is this person, what is this decision this person's getting ready to make? Okay, hold on get a protection stone judgment the resurrection of something here so what are they wanting to resurrect here under the judgment energy what are they wanting to resurrect under the judgment energy please what are they wanting to resurrect yeah yeah new love new love here this person's got the new love feelings here okay Somebody who's very romantic about you, okay? But this person here is definitely wanting to come in here, okay? And take that little handkerchief off the cup here and let this message of love fly. Because there's a bird here in this cup, okay? And birds are messengers here. So what is this message of love here? What is this message here? This emotional message. It's an emotional message. What's this emotional message, please? What's this emotional message here? Ho, oh, ho, not a cups. That they're in love. Yep. An emotional message here of love. This is a beautiful reading here, by, by the way. I really like this energy here. So I'm going to go ahead. I know some people are going to be like, I hate this person. Blah, blah, blah. It'll never happen in a million years. Well, if it's not going to happen, I'm just going to tell you guys this. I, only because I love you, okay? But what you need to do is you need to change your vibration, okay? All right? Sitting in that low frequency shit is not going to do you any good. What you need to do is you need to take your shoes off and go outside and go step in the grass or step in the sand or step in the desert. But beware of, you know, like scorpions and shit if you're in the desert, by the way. And rattlesnakes, you know, that could be really dangerous too. But you need to change your energy. Some of y'all out there, I know I love you. I do. I love you. And I thought about this on my plane ride home. I think about you guys all the time, 24-7, 365 here, okay? But I, I, and, but I love you so much that I want you to raise your energy. Stop saying that shit, okay? All right? Stop making a self-fulfilling prophecy here. And just relax, chill, release your thoughts. Release the negativity, uh, free yourself of that stuff, and just flow. You are two fish. You need to just go, you need to do this like, you know, this number. 
not all the way over here and then back here and this way. You just need to go right here. This is this is where the Pisces needs to be. You need to you're you're going this way, but you're going that way, but you're 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 staying stay see that? That's like two fish together, right? Here you are. Not no, this way. This way, guys. Okay, enough about me. I'm sorry, Pisces. I love you, though. All right, what else do you want to tell Pisces? Okay. Sure. Okay. Uh, this person thinks you are a mystic here. Okay, what else? This person has been having a hard time sleeping. Sure. What else? What's that? And this person is highly attracted to you. So, I love you, my babies. I'll see you on the next read. Carol's adjourned.